What is up guys? Welcome back to Spoil Little Bastards. I'm trying to get the lighting because I'm doing this uh, video at night and it's not really working out for me but that's okay. I am in the Fiat, yes, the 500 Abarth, and we have had some questions asked from you guys about fixing the hyperblink. Hang on, cold start. Oh yeah, Fiat start never gets old. So give me a second and I will show you. God, I look spooky. So I'll show you guys right now. So there is a blinking that is on the dash that you guys can see after installing the Xtron's head unit. And basically this will be a short video on how to do so. Um, I just wanted to, you guys all have all asked me questions about it and now I can answer them. So when your Xtron's hooks up, you know, let's say you are enter up in the CarPlay, I don't have it set up because my Bluetooth's off, but you will click this home button right here. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna go and slide. Now, because this is like the Samsung edition, you're gonna have apps, um, so you're gonna keep going. And you're gonna go to an app that shows this one. It is a little uh, gray and black, black car icon that says car info. You're gonna click that. You're gonna go to this vehicle setup here and it's gonna say model mandatory choice, trying to solve the problem of instrument flashing, which is that instrument right there. So you're gonna go ahead and click this. Now see how it says these options, one, two, three, don't ask what these options are, just this is how to do it, this is the simplest way. Go ahead and click two and you're going to click it, it'll pop up in the top right up there as you guys can see and you're going to turn the car off. Let the whole system reset itself and then, give me a second, turn the car back on. There you guys go. Let me make sure it focuses. Um, obviously my uh, time wasn't set because I had to pull the battery so that's why that was blinking. But that fixes the whole system. That makes it so that the speed, so the, the odometer isn't flashing anymore. So once again, I'll repeat this. You're gonna slide over on your Xtrons unit, go to this car info vehicle setup, and you will go to this model mandatory choice by solve the problem of the instrument flashing. Up here in the corner, you're gonna press either the two, and if the two doesn't work, press the three and go through that, and that will solve your issue. Go ahead, and you can get back into all of your instruments, and you will stop the flashing. So, hopefully you guys, this, I just totally did, <laughs> sorry. It's a little hard doing this without any light because the lights in here, um, they kind of suck, so give me one sec. There we go. So that's how you fix the problem of the uh, beeping or the, um, however you want to put it, just it going in and out. And um, hopefully that helps. If you guys have any other questions, uh, comment them down below. Hopefully this did help. Like I said, I know a lot of you guys with this head unit and possibly some other head units uh, were asking questions on this. So please let me know um, if there's any other way I can help. And uh, if you guys liked it, leave a like, hit that subscribe button, comment down below, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, everyone.